Shalom. First and foremost, I would like to give all praise and glory unto Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, and Chakorash, that will answer to the positive great meals and I do it well, and salutations and blessings to you, I can as pushing his word with true sincerity and charity. All right, amen. I'm just getting to this quick lesson. I'm going to title it, How to Be the Demon. All right, amen. You just seen it. All right, hey, just stand in the spirit, man. All right, don't get carnal with these people, man. All right, don't get them uh, your energy. All right, none of that, man. All right, hey, get them the energy of the spirit, uh, spirit, man. That's it, man. All right, which A is the word, man, according to John 6 and verse 63, man. All right, that's it. That's all we got to do, man. All right, hey, what the brother, the elder brother, uh, Kapatazak, all right, what he, what he, uh, uh, showed there, man. All right, was standing in the spirit, man. All right, not getting carnal. All right, you don't got to, uh, call anybody out their name, man. All right, you don't got to, you don't got to do none of that, man. All right, just read the scriptures, man. Stay in the spirit. All right, Yahweh Shemal Shah is going to deal with these people, man. All right, because hey, at the end of the day, man, these people have demons on them, man. All right, these people are demons, man. All right, they don't want to hear the word, man. All right, once you bring out the word, man, they're going to flee from you, man. Okay, so hey, we need further ado, I'm going to jump into it. Hey, hey, also, hey, man, hey, hey, in the beginning, he was saying that, hey, I, I, I you know, I, I, you saying, but you saying something, but I, I can't hear you. I can't hear you. I, I. I you I don't know what you're saying, you know, and hey, this is the reason why. This is Isaiah six and um let me see. Yeah, I started verse eight. It says, Alas, I heard the voice of Yahweh saying, Whom shall I send and who will go for us? Then said I, Here uh here am I, send me. And he said, Go and tell this people, hear ye indeed, but understand not, and see ye indeed. But perceive not, all right? And, hey, man, that's because these people have a demon on them, man. All right, it's a demon blocking their uh, 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 their understanding, man. All right, it's covering their ears and their eyes, man, so, they think, so that they can't hear 
or that they can't see, man. All right. And it says, make the heart of this people fat and make their and make their ears heavy and shut their eyes, lest they see with their eyes and hear with their ears and understand with their heart and be I'm say and convert and be healed. And amen. That's because the Lord doesn't want a majority of our people to be healed, man. All right. The Lord doesn't want all of our people to understand this and get this message, man. All right. That's why you can't hear this, man. That's why you can't understand this, man. All right. So, amen. Hey, how about Shemal Shai? Hey, this this what the Lord has for uh for those who can't hear, man. For those who, who can't understand this, man. All right. Verse 11, it says, Then said I, uh, Lord, how long? And he and he answered, Until the cities be wasted without inhabitant. All right. And the houses without man and the land be utterly desolate. All right. So, amen. Hey, uh, that's that's uh, two thirds of our people are going to have to understand this at the death by pain, man. All right, that's the only way you're going to understand this, man. All right, after you get hit with those ICBM nuclear missiles, man. All right, or after you after you get your 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 judgment, all right, whatever judgment your Habash Shemal Shah has set up for you, man. All right, hey, after you get that judgment, then you come back into the kingdom, man, in your right mind, man. All right, that's the only way you're going to understand these things, man. It's through death, okay? Hey, man, that man may may very well be, be one of them, man, coming up against the prophet uh, scoffing, man, you know? So, hey. This is James, chapter 4 and verse 7. It says, submit yourselves, therefore, to Yahweh, all right? So, amen, that's what we're supposed to do, man. We're, so, we're supposed to cut off this flesh, man. All right, we're supposed to fight our flesh, man. All right, hey, 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 I'm pretty sure that a, a couple of brothers just wanted to just hit him with an uppercut right quick, man, and just knock his ass out. But, hey, that's not what we about, man. <laughs> that's not what we about. All right, having a carnal mind is uh, uh, enmity with Yahweh by Shemal Shai, man. All right, you supposed to want to, you supposed to stay in the spirit, man. All right, do our, hey, do our job, man. All right, cut these people. All right, fishing, man. We just fishing, man. All right, we trying to see who the elect is, man. All right, that's it. All right, hey, who knows, man? If we, if we, if you know, the brother just kept on uh, standing in the spirit. All right, hey, man, that man could have just, just got right, right then and there, man. But hey, you never know that if you get carnal, you know. But then it says, resist the devil and he will flee from you. All right. So, hey, man, that's what we're supposed to do. All right. Resist the devil, man. All right. Resist the, uh, 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 um, um, our flesh, man. All right. Because uh, Satan plays on your flesh, man. All right. He'll hop on your flesh. All right. When, 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 you, uh, when you're weak, man. All right. When you, uh, um, when you, when you feeling energized, man. You feeling like you want to do something. All right. You want to uh, get at somebody, man. Satan to play on your mind, man. All right. But, hey, if you stay in the spirit and you stay in the spirit, man. All right, which the spirit is the word, man. All right, hey, that's the only way you can resist the devil, man. Stand in the spirit. But hey, if you stand in this flesh, man, hey, Satan is gonna have a hold over you, man. Okay, that's why you see two thirds of people the way they are, man. Off all type of fucking drugs, man, because Satan has a hold on their flesh. But this is John six and verse sixty three. It says, "It is the spirit that quicken it. The flesh profited nothing. The words that I speak unto you." They are spirit and they are life. So, hey, man, these words that we hear, man, these words that that, that you read, all right, in these uh, in the scriptures, man, all right, this is the uh, uh, um, this is the spirit, man, all right, this is the spirit of Yahweh Shmuel Shat, man, all right, this is how you defend, this is how you fight, uh, 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 through everything, man, okay, this is your weapon, man, all right, not your hands, man, okay, not your hands, not not your gun, none of that, man, okay. This is Hebrews 4 and 12. It says, For the word of Yahweh is quick and powerful and sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing even to the asunder, uh, um, uh, it's like it, piercing even to the dividing asunder of soul and spirit and the joints and marrow, and is a discerner of the talk of the thoughts and intent of the heart. Alright, man. So hey man, when you when you prick someone's uh uh um uh eye, ah, all right, it makes tears come out, man. All right, when you prick someone's uh, mind with these scriptures, man, all right, it, it shows their intent, man. All right, and I believe that's in the book of uh, Sirach, I believe, you know. So, hey, man, hey, when you when when you cut these people, man, all right, it's gonna show their true colors, man. All right, just like in the book in the book of Acts, man. All right, when old, when uh, uh, uh um I believe it was when I was five thousand. All right, they had got cut. All right, hey, man, they repented, man. All right, but hey, it was it was I believe it was another um account. All right, well, it was me and the hat got cut, man. Hey, they, 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 they were, um, yeah, yeah, it was Acts seven chapter, man, when they uh, stoned Stephen, you know, they, uh, they got cut, man. All right, they didn't like that, man. They, they covered up their ears, man. They pushed Stephen out the city and stoned him, man. You know, 
So, hey man, hey, it's 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 two type of, it's two type of things that you can do, man. All right, hey, you you can you can uh get cut. All right, repent, man. Get cut and just hey, it, 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 it's not gonna sit well with you, man, because that demon is gonna uh hop on you, man. It's gonna start acting up, you know. But hey, man, our number one defense is these scriptures, man. All right, this is our weapon. This is our, our everything, man. All right, that's why I tell you inside of Ephesians uh, uh the sixth chapter, man, to put on the whole armor of God, man. You gotta put on the whole armor of Yahweh by Shmuel Shah, man. All right. Otherwise, man, you would never be able to. You would never be able to defeat these demons, man. All right. <coughs> so like it. So this is uh Matthew's four and verse one. It says, uh, "Then when Yahweh Shai led up of the spirit into the wilderness to be tempted of the devil, and when he had fasted forty days and forty nights, he was afterwards in hunger. And when the tempter came to him and said, If thou be the son of the son of Yahweh, command." Uh, that these stones be made bread, but he answered and said, "It is written." All right, so Amen. He, he he's gonna uh, uh, um, fight Satan with these scriptures, man. All right, he's not gonna get carnal. All right, Amen. A a Yahweh Shai is uh, 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 um, the right hand of Yahweh, man. All right, he's the right hand of Yahweh. All right, a Yahweh Shai could have could have did anything, man. But hey, what did he do? He defended uh, uh, himself with these words, man. Okay, with the scriptures, with the spirit. And it says, um, it is written, man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeded out of the mouth of Yahweh. Then the devil take it up, take it him up into the holy city and set it him, uh, and set it him on a, um, a, a pinnacle of the temple and said unto him, if thou be the son of Yahweh, cast thyself down for it is written, uh, he shall give his angels charge concerning thee and in their hands uh they shall bear thee up lest at any time thou dash thy foot against a stone yahweh shai said unto him it is written again thou shalt not tempt yahweh thy power again the devil taketh him up into an exceeding high mountain and showed him all the kingdoms of the world and the glory of them Salakia. and said unto him all all these things will i give thee if thou if thou wilt fall down and worship me, and Yahweh Shai said unto him, Get thee hence, Satan, for it for it is written, Thou shalt worship Yahweh thy power, and him only shalt thou serve. All right, man. So hey, he's only defending him with he's only uh fighting him with the with the uh, scriptures, man. All right, he ain't getting a carnal. All right, none of that, man. All right, hey, he ain't cussing him out. None of that, man. Hey, he just bringing out the scriptures, man. All right, just hey, tell him what it is, man. The scriptures give him the understanding, man. You know, it says verse eleven. Then uh, the devil leaveth him, and behold, angels came and ministered unto him. All right, man. So hey, hey, man, resist the devil, and he will flee from thee, man. All right, that's all you gotta do, man. All right, trust in your Shah. All right, keep these, keep uh, the spirit on you, man. All right, just keep the spirit on you. Keep keep uh, fighting with these words, man. Okay, say, hey, man, that's our ultimate defense. So this is Proverbs 28 and verse 1. It says, The wicked flee when no man pursue it, but the righteous are bold as a lion. All right, man? So, hey, man, these demons are going to flee once you start to get in the spirit, man. Once they see that you're not, you're not about nothing that, they, nothing that they with, man. All right? You ain't getting, you ain't going to get carnal with them or nothing, man. All right? They don't like that, man. So, hey, they're going to flee from you, man. They're gonna flee because hey, you're 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 not uh, uh doing doing anything according to to what to what they want you to do, man. You know you stand in the spirit, all right. You stand focused on on the words of Yahweh Shem Al Shai, man. All right, and the Lord is gonna fight for you, man. All right. Is at the end of the day, man? The Lord is on our side, man. So this is Romans eight. <coughs> this is Romans eight and uh, verse six. Yeah, verse six it says, "For to be carnally minded is death." But to be spiritually minded is life and peace. But the carnal mind is enmity against Yahweh, for it is not subject to the law of Yahweh, neither can be. All right, man? So, hey, having a carnal mind is going to bring you death, man. All right? But, hey, being spiritual is going to bring you life. All right? It's going gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna to keep you uh, uh, um, uh, stable, man. All right? It's going to keep you uh, inside, inside these times to come, man. All right? And hey, ultimately, man, stand stand spiritual is gonna uh 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 um 
Amen. Stand spiritual is gonna keep you. Is, is gonna keep you on the ways of Yahweh Shemal Shaman. All right, it's not gonna lead you. It's, it's not gonna lead you astray. All right, and make you wanna uh, uh, um, um, get carnal with somebody. Make you wanna fight, man. All right, it's not gonna make you wanna cut somebody out, man, and, and call them at their name, man. All right, stand inside these scriptures is gonna help you uh, 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 bring in the elect, man. All right, because at the end of the day, we're we're fishing right now, man. All right, this ain't this ain't the hunt. This not hunting season time. All right, the Lord is gonna let us loose off our leash, man, in due time, man. All right, but hey, with that, man, we're gonna have to wait, uh, wait with spiritual powers, man. We're gonna have to deal with spiritual powers, man, and we're gonna have to wait for Yahweh Shmuel Shah to do that as well, man. All right, we're nothing but worms right now, man. All right, so hey, man, we're always gonna be dealing with this, dealing in the spirit, man. Okay, and it's uh, hey, hey, having a carnal mind is empty with Yahweh Shmuel Shah, man. All right, hey, ha having uh, being carnal. All right, wanted to wanted to uh, uh, do think with your flesh first, man. All right, instead of the scriptures, man, like it's saying Proverbs uh, third chapter, man, fifth verse. All right, lean not unto thy own understanding, man. All right, you're not supposed to lean to your own understanding, but lean to the understanding of your Shmuel Shah, man. Okay, because hey, your flesh cannot be subject to the law, man. Okay, so it says, so then they that are in the flesh cannot please your All right, man. So hey, if you're in this, if you're if you're in the flesh, man. You can't please your how about Shemal Shah, but if you're in the spirit, you can, man. All right? So, let me get this. Because, hey, like I said, the Lord is on our side at the end of the day. So, this Proverbs 6 and verse 7 it says, When a man's ways please your how, he make it eat, he make it any, um, Salaki, he make it even his enemies to be at peace with him. All right? So, hey, man, hey, that, that, that's a pleasing thing. And as of your how about Shemal Shah, man. All right, to see you uh, 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 resist Satan, man. All right, with the scriptures, man. All right, the same way that uh, uh, Yahweh Shah did when he was tempted, man. All right, just fighting, just fighting Satan with these scriptures, man. All right, hey, 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 man. Hey, this, this what I'm talking about, man. Like the brother said, this what I'm talking about. You know, just hey, keep bringing out these scriptures, man. All right, that's it. All right, and the Lord will fight for us, man. All right, the Lord will make uh, 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 um, our enemies flee from us, man. You know. Because at the end of the day, the Lord controls all these peoples, man. All these people, man. You know? So this Proverbs 20, verse 24. Man's goings are of the Lord. How can a man then understand his own way? All right, man? So, hey. Hey, the Lord sent that man up there, man, to be a demon, man. All right? Hey, sent, it, sent him to be cut, man. All right? Hey, sent him to be cut. All right? Sent him to be an example, man. All right? Hey, and, 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 and for the brother to, um, um, um. You know, for the and, and, and for the Lord to show through the brother how to deal, how to deal in the spirit, man. All right, just stay in the spirit, stay in these scriptures, man. Cut these people, man. All right, it's no need to get carnal, man. You know. So hey, I pray that this lesson was edifying. I would like to give all praise, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Chakurash, that will answer the other apostles of great mills and a doer will, and salutations and, and blessings to you, I can as pushing his word with true sincerity and charity. Shalom and a Bible ball.